welcome to indian tech guru for you in this video let us learn java classes that are supported for byte streams so as far as the io streams are concerned there are two types of io streams that are supported by java so one category is byte streams another category is character streams so in this video let us learn the class hierarchy for byte streams java classes hierarchy for byte streams so all we know that uh, in java the ultimate super class for all the classes is object class as usual the classes that are needed for byte streams are derived from the object class for both input as well as output purposes two streams are derived from the object class they are input stream input stream class and the output stream class input stream class and the output stream class so these classes uh, are derived from the object class so now let us see what are the classes that are derived from the input stream class as well as the output stream class separately so as far as the input stream class is concerned input stream class is derived from the object class input stream class so now for file manipulation purposes we will have derived class from input stream class known as the file input stream file input stream class file input stream class is used to manipulate data stored in files as well as retrieve data from the files this particular class is used so another class which is derived from the input stream class is byte array input stream byte array input stream class so this class is used to manipulate with the byte arrays and perform the input operation and the third one is filtered input stream filtered input stream class so these are the mostly used classes that are derived from the input stream class what are they file input stream byte array input stream filtered input stream and uh, there are three more sub classes for the filtered input stream filtered input stream will have three more sub classes so let us see what are, what are they the first one uh, that is derived from the filtered input stream class is buffered input stream buffered input stream class and the second class that is derived from the filtered input stream class is data input stream class data input stream class and the last one is pushback input stream class pushback input stream class so these are all the different classes uh, that are der derived from the input stream class so basically file input stream byte array input stream and filtered input stream classes are derived from the input stream class and uh, buffered input stream data input stream and pushback input stream classes are derived from the filtered input stream class now let us see the classes that are derived from the output stream class as we have already seen that output stream class is derived from the object class output stream class is derived from the object class now various uh, 
classes are derived from the output stream class so the first one is file output stream class file output stream class which is used for file output the second one is a byte array output stream class byte array output stream class which is used for byte array operations and the third one is filter output stream class filter output stream class so these are the three basic classes that are derived from the output stream class and three more classes are derived from the filter output stream class they are data output stream data output stream class and the second one is buffered output stream class buffered output stream class and the last one is pushback output stream class pushback output stream class so these are the various classes that are derived from the output stream file output stream byte array output stream filter output stream and the subclasses for filter output stream are data output stream buffered output stream pushback out output stream so this is the class hierarchy classes hierarchy for input stream as well as the output stream which are referred as byte streams in the next video we will see the class hierarchy for the character streams hope you like this video thanks for watching that's all for now